There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, Divas and Divas? So it's your girl, April, and I'm back to do another affordable lace front wig. This one is available at ebonyline.com. I'll make sure to post the link below for you guys. So first of all, let me just talk about this wig. I don't really know how I'm feeling about it. Like, I'm, I like it. It looks really cute on the model. Like, so don't get me wrong, but um, I don't really know if I'm going to be able to pull this off. Like, a girl is, like, very hesitant about pulling this out the bag and putting it on especially when the wig bag itself be like so big and puffy that you just be like dang they couldn't even get that in the bag and i'm supposed to put this on my head so you know listen uh, yes so this one okay is by one of my favorite brands you know what i say team sensational this is game changer okay game changer now y'all see i left her in the bag normally i already have her out but do you see how fluffy this bag is like this thing is like fluffy i got her in the color number four you know this is recommended for curly 3b to 3c coily 3c to 4a kinky 4b to 4c hair so i'm not really sure when they say recommended for meaning those who have this type of hair texture is this going to be suitable more suitable for you i'm not really sure but that's what wigs are for they're not just because we have like that certain hair texture i think they're just an accessory to us at this point in our you know our life i feel like a wig is an accessory like the earrings the head scarf girl a wig is an accessory okay she looks absolutely gorgeous on this um photo stock photo so we're gonna see like i said she's available at ebony line ebony line okay ebony line I will definitely post it. I'll definitely post it down below, you guys. Oh my god. So, on that note, let's get into this tutorial, okay?
All right, you guys, so I don't really know how I feel about this wig game changer. It definitely is a changer. I'm not really sure how I feel about it. It's a lot of hair, like super duper like hair all over the place. Um, I would think like you would, might want to thin it out a little bit because it does kind of get like very kind of like uneven and very stiff in the back right there. And I just really don't like the way the back is just kind of like stiff and just laying like, I just see it tangling really bad and just looking so bad in the back that you don't know um, what's going on. You know how you have your hair and you feel like it looks really, really good. And then when you turn around or you look elsewhere, you're like, was I walking around like this all day? So you will definitely either have to thin it out in the back. I would, I would, I would think for the back that you would want it to be shorter underneath, so that way it doesn't tangle real bad. Um, this texture is really nice. Um, I do like the texture, but for some people, it's a lot. For me, I would probably like wrap a headscarf around this and just put it up in like a really cute updo. It does have a texture to it. You really don't have to like uncomb or uncurl the curls. You can just wear it exactly as it is straight out the bag because it's already big. And I think over time, it'll just like fluff its own self up. I feel like that lady, um, she had like, it's not a bad wig, but it, I just feel like I look like her. You know the woman, um, the one who was working for the NAACP, NAACP, she was the president of the NAACP. Come to find out she wasn't an African American, but she had on a wig that was like similar to this, okay? I feel like her right about now. However, I am an African American. But I just feel like that because of the hairstyle. Like, I don't know. I don't really think that it's for me, um, per se. Probably because I have like this long head, you know, so I definitely need to cover it up some type of way. But it is a lot of hair. But the color is nice and the texture is nice and the style is nice. It's just basically your prefer preference to each his own. But if you do like this game changer, you can definitely check out Ebony online. I will post all the information below along with the coupon code. But yes, you guys, you can definitely check EbonyLine.com. This one is not for me at all. I love you guys. Stay deep and deep delicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. Now I've got myself looking really crazy at the end. And yeah, um, I will see you guys in a soon to come video.